there, it's Angela Hockman. Thank you so much for tuning in to STL TV where you get to experience St. Louis. Now today, there's already this like empowering vibe in the studio. And I think it is because I have Dr. Ava Smith on. She is the founder and CEO of the She Agency, all about women's empowerment, pushing you to your maximum potential and so many other things. So. Dr. Smith, should we call you Dr. Smith? Yes, that's fine. Okay, okay, how are you? I'm great, thank you Angela for having me. I'm so grateful to be here. That introduction was amazing. You're Thank welcome. You. You're welcome. <laughs> I know. I'm like, how do you introduce someone that is an author, an educator, a speaker, a coach, <laughs> and 17 other things? I'm sure. Well, thank you. I'm humble, right? I'm I'm grateful to be here, and I'm excited to just get out here and just talk about empowering women. Yes. Well, then let's talk about that. So, okay. what is the She Agency? Why did you start it? Fill me in. Yeah. So, the She Agency is a non-profit organization which I literally just started in May, um, and it stemmed from the She Effect. LLC. And so I started that right before COVID. What is that? So she stands for Strong, Humble, Effective Influencer. Okay. Yep, little fun tidbit. I wondered why it was <laughs> spelled S-H-E-I. Yeah, so a little fun tidbit. My middle name is Vershika. Okay. And it's spelled V-E-R-S-H-E-I-K-A. So the she comes from that. So it's a little piece of me. So why not give a piece it. of me to everybody else? It's so personal and yeah. so empowering. So yeah, so what exactly does the agency do? Who, who do you work with? Yeah, so we work with girls, women, and athletes of all ages. Um, oh. Particularly right now, I'm working with 18 and older, women of ages 18 and older. And so what we do is we try to empower them and reach them where they are, build mm -hmm. them up on the principles of she. And what are those principles? Strong, humble, effective, and influencer. Okay, you're like, were you listening five minutes ago? <laughs> no, you're good. <laughs> I like that. Okay, basically, be someone that you want to be around. Absolutely. That's, that's Absolutely. how I translated that. So can you talk even a bit more, a little bit about the vision behind this? Because this is a new agency for you. It is. This business model is so unique. So talk about the mission and vision. Right, so being in education, now I've been in education now for about 13 years. Um, I, I taught sophomore English and special education for a little bit, and now I'm into technology. So I've been doing, I'm, in my fifth year, I'm a district technology instructional coach. And so um, I still work with the kiddos, but I work with adults as well, and so I love doing that, right? But what I found in being in education in the city of St. Louis is some of our young women, our young ladies, they just need guidance, they need mm -hmm. help, they need assistance. And then also in coaching basketball, which I do coach boys basketball, Oh, do um, you? I do. And you have a basketball career of your own, too. I don't do. think we're not talking about that. <laughs> <laughs> I do, but uh, just going through life and things of that nature, just learning that everyone needs somebody. Mm -hmm. um, but you also need to learn how to have that self-motivation, right, and build yourself up. And so I wanted to start the SHE Agency, focus on girls, women, and, and athletes because of my connection with them. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, and just getting them to understand that no matter where you are in life, what stage, what status you are, you can be what you want to be or who you want to be no matter what anyone else says. Gosh, and you are just the push that people need. Some people, they're just not aware of their potential. They don't Absolutely. know the great things that they can do, whether that's just not the way they were brought up or that's not the way they're wired to think Absolutely. or that wasn't you know part of their upbringing. So yeah. the fact that you unlock this potential and you just get these girls and women thinking really big, how yes. does that make you feel? Good, because I had you know people in my life um, to push me and to instill certain attributes that I currently have to this day and build my character and things of that nature. Um, I had my parents, obviously, but you know, when you get, you get older and you, you're in this path of, I could do this, I could do that, why can't we just do all of those things at some point, right? I agree. And so I, I try to let them know that it is okay, no matter how big, how small, that you may think it is, it's not. As long as you believe in yourself and the things that you're trying to do, mm -hmm. you got it. It's gonna be great. That's, sometimes I feel like that's easier said than done. Absolutely. But thanks to this handy dandy book called The She Principles, I feel like everything that you're saying and explaining truly is attainable. It might seem light years away, but it's like just, if you focus on something and stay committed to it and have someone like the She Agency right. pushing you and ins inspiring you and encouraging you. Yeah. Um, so talk about this. So. How to become a she in 30 days. Yes, it's interactive. Okay. It's a journal, is what it basically is. However, it. it talks about the principles of she in the beginning and explains that to you. And you have to commit for 30 days 
to be consistent mm -hmm. and disciplined. Um, what I love about this book is it talks about gratitude. Every day, Every right? single day. Be consistent with giving gratitude. It doesn't matter what it is. It could, you could wake up in the morning and say, I'm glad to see birds or hear the birds chirping outside, mm -hmm. right? Something that small is giving gratitude. Yeah. And we have to learn um, as humans to just, no matter what we're going through, doesn't matter, give thanks and be consistent yes. with that. That positive mindset keeps you going. And there is something about the gratitude specifically that helps kind of quiet that noise mm -hmm. that the world can sometimes try to let in. Mm -hmm. And you're like, no, I just, I'm, all I want is to be my best self <laughs> so that I can live this wonderful life because yes. life is short, so why yes. not be your best self? And in 30 quick days, mm -hmm. how do you want people to be transformed? Just to understand that the consistency is the key and, and just have discipline because everything we do in life, career, parenting, sports, it doesn't matter. You practice it and you keep going. Mm -hmm. And what I really want people to understand is if you're consistent with what you do, it'll make a habit out of it. Absolutely. And it will change you. And so that's, that's the big key right there. Yeah. The more you do it, the easier it gets and you just keep going. And so much of it is a mindset. People might look at this and think, I don't have time for 30 mm. days to do this. Everyone has at least 30 seconds. I mean, do this in the bathtub. Yeah. <laughs> I get a lot of work done in the bathtub, I mean, I'm not gonna lie, but like everyone has a couple minutes to yeah, handle Yeah, we can this. watch our favorite TV show. Yes. If we can, you know, I, I couldn't think of anything. Go work out for 30 minutes. We can yeah. write for five. Yeah. Right. Because at no. the end of the day, it's it's the work on ourselves that is truly going to change our trajectory. Um, I want to talk about one quote and then you have an event coming up. We're going to unpack too. What does this mean to you? I was not built to break. Right. So it could be a cliche, right? However, because we have so many things we go through. I know for myself, um, I grew up in a household where I was pushed, but I'm grateful for the push now. Um, my father's a retired principal. My mom's a retired educator and coach. And, you know, it's that saying, you fall down, you get back up, no matter yeah. how many times it takes. And it's really Shoulder instilled off. in, yeah, dust it off. It's really instilled in that. I might go through hardships and, and trials and tribulations, but I'm going to give myself 24 hours and I'm going to move on because I'm not, I'm not going to break. Oh, 24 hours, that. that's it. Cry it out, holler, scream, whatever yes. you need to do and keep going. The fact that there is an expiration date <laughs> on that sort of like wallowing time, that's genius. Some people yeah. think, oh, I just need a week to just... We don't always have a week to we spend, don't. you know, in that phase. Yep. And let's be honest, no one likes to be in that no. mindset anyway. It's not fun. It's yeah. not good. So, okay, give yourself 24 hours, Keep move going. on. Yes. Amazing. And it's not perfect. You're not going to be perfect at it. No. And it takes time. It takes practice. Yeah. And there's little consistency and, you know, things there, but it's okay. Well, talk about the event because you are going to transform many people's lives on hey. August 11th, I'm right around excited. the corner. What's going on on this empowerment event? All right, so August 11th from 11 to 2, we're having a women's empowerment seminar. I have some amazing, amazing women who have agreed to be a part of this oh, event. Can you give me a teaser? Um, Who's going to speak? I think I can give this now. Okay. We have the mayor, Tashira Jones. Oh. Okay. She will be in attendance. Okay. And she's one of our TJ. panelists. So I'm excited oh. to have her. Yeah. Um, I'm just excited for the wisdom and the leadership that they're going to bring to the table. Mm -hmm. And I tell people, whenever you get a chance to have a seat at the table, have a seat. Yes. And just soak in all the information that you get. I mean, imagine people walking in at, you know, 1045, at 201, yes. they could potentially be transformed. Yes, and I'm excited. Yeah, so yes, the right. event is, it's got panels. What else can people expect? Um, we have speakers, we have panelists, and then there's actually going to be a networking piece. So after the event is over, you know, I hope that people stick around and stay yes. and just get all of that wisdom and networking that they can. Connections yes. will be made. Friendships will be made. <laughs> Absolutely. This is, this is going to be huge. And it's down at the Commerce Bank yes. on Euclid, yes. conveniently located between Hot Box, Hot Box. Cookies and Whole Foods. Yep. Yes. <laughs> you are speaking all my food language. Yes. Again, the Women's Empowerment Seminar is happening. It's around the corner, guys. Get your tickets on. Eventbrite, there is a promo code you can use. She's 24. S-H-E-I 24 for a lovely little discount. Thank you so much for that. Yes. Again, Sunday, August 11th from 11 to 2, only 
three hours, but it is going to be a lifetime full of wonderful tidbits, wisdom, inspiration, and friendships. So get ready. Also check out her website. It's on the screen and there was a lot going on, but you can find yourself a book and be even the best version of yourself by day 31. Dr. Ava yes. Smith, it's been so fun to talk with you. Thank you for your time. Thank you for having me. Good luck at the event. I might thank see you, you there. Thank you. Yay. Yeah. I'm so excited. Um, and after you grab your tickets on Eventbrite, scroll on over through the STL TV social media channels. We got a lot going on on all of those. And you can also check out the website, learn a little bit more about who we are and the personalities behind STL TV. So that's going to do it, friends. I'm Angela Hockman. I appreciate you tuning in where you get to experience St. Louis. See you next time.